back folks, so we've got a problem in here, something's uh, causing this to leak out quite severely. I don't know if you can see that, but looking down there, everything looks fine. So, it could be something inside of this particular piece here that's causing us grief. Only one thing to do, get out some tools. Bosch PSR Select to be more precise. Done a review of this drill. If you want to have a hunt for it, I might chuck a, a description in the link below. But a uh, handy little unit. Terrific. Off of here, Hopefully you guys can see that. Okay, so let's pull them off. I imagine this is going to be a little bit tricky in German. We'll see how we go. These things are normally put together quite well. So, what we need to do is to find a just part and part and be really careful with how it comes off. Because this is where things start flying everywhere and you have trouble putting it all back together. So we'll just take our time getting into this here. So it looks like um, the handle is stuck together by our means. There we go, so it's just a matter of pulling that top part of the handle off. Oh, there's a couple of little points there they are attached but yep she pulls straight off okay so that's good news I didn't see any springs flying anywhere all right so okay straight away we've got a spring which needs to sit back up on there so let's have a look at that okay See if we can replicate the action of what's going on outside. So we pull that in. And it's leaking out of here. Now it's either coming out of here and all the way down or it's leaking out of here directly. I tend to think it's leaking out of here directly. So let's see if we can carefully pull that off. Okay, so we have an O-ring here and a spring there. Okay, so we just have a spring inside there, and we have an O-ring here, on this piece here. So if this O-ring here isn't working properly, which I believe it is because it feels quite snug. Yeah, well, I believe that's working properly. And all we have left is this part down here. Okay. Which uh, cannot be opened up or gone into. Let's have a look inside there. I don't know if you guys can see this. I'm just having a look inside here to see what the actual layout is in there. It's very hard to see inside there. But it looks like we're not getting any purchase inside of there, which is why it's tending to leak. Okay. So let's take these out. Got some more O-rings in here. Which look pretty good. That still looks pretty good. And that's looking pretty good. Okay. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right. Okay, let's put them back together. Just need to remember where everything went. It doesn't feel too bad that join there. It's a little bit loose, which could cause some water to come out. I might, um, while I've got this apart, take this washer off. I'm hoping we've got one here that will do this job. It doesn't look like there is one specifically for this, however... I don't think that is meant to be that piece, but... I'm going to use it anyway, so it looks good to me. No, that's way, way too big. Miles too big. Miles and miles and miles too big. It's too big as well. Okay. So it looks like we could be stuck here a little bit, folks. That's no good. That one's no good. That one's no good. That one's no good. And I believe that's a problem. There's a bit of play there. So I think the water's going up here, squirting out there, returning back down the handle, which is why it's all wet in here, and going back out the bottom. I might just do a quick fix to see if this is the issue. see if we can seal this up and then I'll have to look at getting this particular o-ring which doesn't come in that kit which is a pity let's see if we can uh, do a bit of backyard fixing here okay so that's gone in there okay now when you take something off it never goes back the same way as you removed it does it see that doesn't look right in there either looks a little bit bent to me inside that yes it is oh, look at that it's a bit bent isn't it I don't think that's our problem though however it wasn't straight, which would explain why it didn't fit properly. There you go, folks. Hope I'm saving you guys some time here by me wasting my time. All right, so now where did this go? There's up there. Feel free to talk amongst yourselves, guys. I believe that went through there. That went there. That went there, that went there. Okay. That went on there. Went back over there. That goes down there, that sits on there. And we just need to put the handle on the bottom. Hopefully and quickly before it pops out. Let's see. Together. Good. Test, test, test. Okay. Yep, that was fun. Well, Yep, 
Moving over the top, put some uh, parping tape underneath the O-ring, slid the O-ring over the top. Feels like it's a bit tighter now. So let's put it together and have a look. Okay, let's go test it out. 